pressure. Oh, baby, bike. What up, YouTube? It's your boy, Pubs. And today I want to talk to you about something that I go through and I'm sure a lot of you do with Call of Duty. That feeling that something just ain't right. You know what I'm talking about, right? You know, you, you're you in the mood to play some Call of Duty. You get home or you, you stop doing whatever you're doing. You, you fire up the Xbox One or the PS4. You load up the latest Call of Duty game. And you get into a lobby and you start playing the game. And at that very first gun exchange or that very first death, you say to yourself, something doesn't feel right. Like you could tell, you could tell after a couple of days, the game running perfect for you, running smooth as shit. you like, eh, something doesn't feel right. And you're trying to think, is it lag? Is it the server? You know, you try, what, what, is, what is it? What is it? And then you keep playing the game and take a couple more bullshit deaths. Or maybe like you do kill the person, be like, ah, it took me more bullets than normal. Or, or it just felt like you weren't getting hit registration at all on somebody and then finally you dropped them. And it's just the whole game is just playing on your mind like, man, something is not right with this game. Next game comes along, you decide, you know what? I'm going to get a new lobby. So you go to a different lobby. Game starts up, same thing. You're playing couple of debts here or there or whatever it is but you're just like something is not right with this game game's over or maybe you quit out of that game you get a new lobby same thing happens you're like what, what the hell's going on here this is something not right with this game today something just seems off you ever get in that situation like i said like you know you've been playing the game for a couple of days straight every day pretty much majority of the games they're running smooth, no issues. You know, every now and then you might get a game with a little lag in it. But then you get on one day and it it's like that. You just, every game, you're not seeing lag. It's not glitchy. You know, it just seems that like you're a second behind or the hit registration is off. And you're saying to yourself, well, I didn't change anything on my end. You check your internet. You're like, nope, internet good. And just like, well, what, what could it be? You know, you, you do that stupid shit like, you reboot your modem, your router. <laughs> you do a hard reset on your Xbox or your PS4. You know, you do all that dumb shit just to make sure it's not on your end. But you know in your mind, after playing Call of Duty for years, that, especially in the last couple of years, it's the game. And whatever little changes they make in these little game setting updates that you get or these, you know, patches you get, they'll never truthful on all those notes that we see. You know, what they said they did. You know, some, you could tell when something changes. So for me, prime example, last couple of days, I've been playing Call of Duty every day, trying to get gameplays for videos for, for YouTube, right? And uh, I'm switching back over to Xbox One for the weekend so I can play some Battlefield because I have Battlefield 4 on PC and Xbox One, but I want to play with some old gaming buddies. So I had to get in. In early in this week, I wanted to get in, you know, a good amount of Black Ops 3 gameplays. So I've been playing, and the game's been running great. Smooth, no problem. And then yesterday I jump on, and it was a game setting update. They changed, well, they said they changed Fracture, where Fracture now counts as an objective game mode. And I think they changed the score limit. All right. Innocent enough. So I jump on, the game loads up, and it does its whole little thing, and it says, oh, downloading, and the game settings changed or whatever, and it's downloading this thing. Then I go play, and the game just felt off. It just felt nothing like it felt the last couple of days. It just felt off. So I played a couple, couple of games, and I was just like, I'm not doing this. I'm not. Every lobby, every game mode, I played different game modes, and I said, I'll try again later. So, I turned off the PS4, went and did other shit. And then uh, later on, I was on Twitter and I saw my boy Fist was streaming. So I said, oh, you know, I'm sitting on my computer. Let me let me throw up Fist's stream, show a little support. This is where he's got a viewer there. I might not be able to watch the whole thing or listen to the whole thing. But, you know, I'll peep the first couple of minutes when I jump on and I'll just check in randomly from here and there. But I like to show my support. I like to, you know, say hello in the sh in the chat. I like to make sure my views being counted for him. It's important. Guy's a COD vet. 
And uh, he's just bitching and complaining that he's losing these gun battles. He's like, what the hell? He's like, you know, he's like, why is it? You know, he's He gets killed by somebody using the same gun he was using. He's using a VMP, right? And he's like, look at that shit. How is that guy's VMP firing faster than my damn VMP? And he's just like, I don't get it, man. It's just like some reason, like, they're screwing with me. They're slowing down my fire rate. And I'm just in the chat like, nah, man, the connections, there's something up with this last game settings. So last night I jump on, I only had uh, about an hour to kill. I jumped on late and I noticed I was having trouble finding games. Like there was less games to find. And I'm like, the hell's, what is going on? And then the games I did get in, I saw a lot of shady shit. Like my shot was off. Like everything just... Like everything, like like the uh, the aim assist was pulling me like way over the target. It was just so bizarre. Like I was like, "What the hell?" And I'm thinking, "Oh, maybe it's me. Maybe I'm just like too hyped up on caffeine or some shit. I don't know." So, turn it off. And then uh, today, I had about two hours to kill, and I said, "Oh, okay. You know what? Let me jump on uh, PS4. Let me fire up some uh, Black Ops Three. Let me see if I can get some gameplays." And um, same shit. Same shit. There was a game setting update again, and the game just ran horrible. The game just ran horrible. I mean, there would be people sitting in corners that I knew were there, like, at a good distance, and I'm shooting at them, and I'm not even getting hit registry, and then the dude's, like, wakes up and just pops me with one bullet. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? So anyway, that's just what I wanted to say. I know you guys all been through this. I, I, I don't think I'm alone in this, but it's that moment where you, you, you want to play COD. COD's been running good. You, you fire up the game, you get in the game, and you're like, you know, you know something ain't right with the game. Anyway, I'm your boy, Pubs, and I'm out to next time. Stay real, keep it real, and I'll do the same. Thank you for the support on the channel. Love you.